Generic greetings and welcome back to Airships Conquer the Skies once again. In the previous episode, we broke the game. We have 45,751 generic units of currency and we're receiving nearly 500 a day. And we now have two cities on the bottom left, as you can see. It's just about messing around, building some interesting stuff and uh, trying some of the mod stuff out. So on the right-hand side, you can see we've got a bit of an alliance going here. Three people, uh, or rather three cities in the same alliance there. Up top, you can see it's pretty much controlled by one person as well. Three and three. And then over on the left, uh, we've got this other guy as well. So if I can make it, if I can take this over, then we've got three, three, and three. So uh, it's about even. So let's just see what we can do. We do have as you can see, several KV2 Ing Ton, and there should be Ing Tons, plural, but we also have whatever this thing is, the centipede, this weird thing that we start with. So they worked out quite well, but we've also managed to build, or we will if I unpause it for a moment, we'll almost uh, be just about finishing the... the um, the big drone ship, which is an interesting beast. I hope it doesn't blow up because... Well, quite honestly, it's taken us a while to make it here. Um, also, you can see this here. It says, this is Suspendium Experts. High tech and over the top Suspendium crystal knowledge. Man should never peer this deep into the dark and shiny. And that's something that we could have picked when we did the campaign. So I know people want me to uh, do something here. As you can see, we've got, oh my good grief, a lot of ships. So I probably need more than one I have to take that out. So let's go to build ship and we will build, we can build anything. We've got block gun into chop firing turn. I mean, we've got so much cash that it's not going to matter. Um, however, I think maybe the way to go, reacting tons have, all, have always been very, very good. Uh, we've also got the what WTFington because it's just a big honking space cannon. The Zeppelins, um, you know what, I think we're probably gonna make Zeppingtons because they are the tried and true, let's just get this one and done sort of uh, jobs. They are very good at uh, doing just that. So let's go to build airship. Oh, they're coming, oh, they're going for the ruins here. Uh, we'll go for build ship. And go down. We're going to make the... Oh, you can see islands as well. Look at this. This is um, something I know a lot of people want me to make, which I'll be doing probably later on. Um, you can actually make islands. You, you have the suspendium crystal and you can place them just like you would build anything else, which is really, really, really weird, but also cool at the same time. They just float about, you see. Um, and we'll go for a Zeppington V2. There we go. Now, I could actually alter that now that I think about it because we do have... We do have... A, I'm pretty sure we do have a a heavy bomb bay, so we could we could alter that. But uh, well, let's see what goes. So for some reason it takes an age to make these. I don't know if that's been altered in the patch or whatever. But we'll just speed up to max speed while we crack on there. And once this second one's done, I do want to go to defenses here. Go over to the build building and probably put in. Well, there's a tiny trench. Look, there's actually a trench system. And we've got our t the forest artillery station is probably the way to go. And then we'll put it, um, well, we'll put it right at the back like so. All right. So at least we have some defenses there because otherwise well, we just don't. So we'll go to again. Uh, actually, should we design something? Let's design, a, let's design a land ship this time. So what sort of weapons could we put on a land ship? Well, I fancy something really, really stupid. Like, like, what the hell is that? Not like that? Super Heavy Fortress Cannon? Uh, technically we can put tracks on it. Well, we are going to do some sieges as well. Mm, okay, right, uh, let's, let's try that and see how it goes. So, propulsion, obviously we are going to put some large tracks on this beast, so it's like that. And, do I want to put it like that? Yeah, I think I do, that's about, that's about read. Okay, so. That's in. We will then have to command it somehow. So recommend the crew 11. So it's actually quite small for this. But once you consider everything at the back, we're probably going to be around the sort of 2022 20, amount. Uh, we could put some commerce on it and make it <laughs> make it make money on the way there. Uh, I don't think we'd need to do that. So we will have um, a large quarters which has how many crew? 40 air sailors. We don't need that. We need, however, this one here which is... 12 air sailors, I think that's about right. Two of those will be more than sufficient. We will put... Actually, we're not going to put them there. We'll probably put them about there. The reason for that is we want to go over to resources and fire point. Put a fire point in like so. Mm, yeah, we need a coal store. And then we need an ammo store, which we are already running out of space. Didn't think I'd run out of space, but... 
What I'll do is I'll move stuff further back, you see, like that and like that. We'll have a double call like so, and then we will have a probably probably go for just a bit of a corridor. The whole point is that this thing is not supposed to be... The hell's that? That's tracks. Oh, that's it. I don't know why it's in that section. Um, the whole point is that we will have the central corridor up here. Actually, you don't need it because, look, that goes up as well. Yes, yeah, so we really just don't need anything going up this spine. But I think because we haven't really got anything else, that structural castle walls. This is fairly oh god, oh, on a vault door. Cool. Don't need any of that. Right, we do need somewhere to get up and down. So we're gonna have a deck or a corridor. Corridor, we're forward, I think. Straight up the top, like so. And we need we need ammo. How much does it use? Real time, eight seconds. I would have thought it's a bit more than that. Um, look at that blast, eight hundred piercing damage, eight hundred. Yeah, it's a big cannon. Who would have thought, huh? I don't know whether we need double coal. How much does it use? Unit of coal every eight seconds, and how many units does this have? Thirty-two. So actually, only one then. One should one should do. Should. Should. Anyway, we might put more on. This is actually, after all, a siege weapon. So we shouldn't really be moving around and doing much more. Anyway, so we'll go over to resources. And you can have a big ammo store now, which is cool. Which I think that makes total sense of us having that. And then we'll put more crew in it. We've got 36 crew. Far too much. We'll take that off then. We will have a... Another corridor going up like that because we're going to put like the bridge on top. And while we're on it, we'll go over to the command and crew. We want a crow's nest right on the top. We want a a large bridge. No, I think just a standard bridge would be sufficient. And then we do need some way of connecting this up. We need more supply hatches. Yes, I'm aware. Is that just the task? Is, do that, is that all we need? Just put three supply hatches and then it's done? We can't repair this and we can't heal the crew, but as I said, if this thing's getting shot or boarded, then we've done something very, very wrong indeed. We could also, if we wanted to, put a... Uh, is it in C weapons? Yeah, you can put a, a mobile artillery support module on the back. <laughs> Yeah, we're going to have to try one of those. I think we'll try one of those next time. Uh, right, I think it's just... Let's just get some basic supply hatches on it. So, supply hatch, one, two, three, job done. And then armor. Um, I think... I think steel armor is the way to go. But it does really increase it. It's weight. Titanium. Oh, yeah, look at the cost in it. No, 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 no. Minimalist paneling. What, are we Lawrence Rowland Bowen now? <laughs> no, I don't think so. Let's go for steel wall, perhaps. Yeah, I think that's about right. Steel wall, is that is that is that comparable to wooden armor? No, it's a bit better. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. It wouldn't make it would look a bit dodgy with it. Bit, bit, it would really look stupid if it was. Well, it does look stupid already. Let's just get that out of the way now. But it would look even worse if it had. Um, wooden armor on it so we will go for the i'm not going to go for the mouth because this will go up and down so it won't really match up uh, although it will look fairly interesting when we do that so i think we'll we'll stick with it and we'll put a nameplate in about there i think job done right uh one more thing let's go down to solid iron slopes or actually no do we have girders we do have girders I'm going to put in a couple of girder sections. Because we can. Because it makes it look a little bit better. I think. There we go. Okay. Uh, so it's going to be called the GLV. And... Hmm. Hmm. It's going to be the OT Teamton because it is over the top. The OT Teamton. Save design. Save. Build. 
Okay, so that is okay. We're building that. And we will speed up. Because it takes forever to build, apparently. And that's a medium shipyard as well. So we do need a bigger shipyard. Ooh, 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 this is interesting. Look at that, he's going over there. He's going to... He's moving over to attack that. Let's go to View City. We can't destroy any of these, by the way, because these must have secret police on absolute max. Uh, what about over here? Oh, yeah, they've put secret police up. And oh, my good grief, look at this. They're just building and building and building. I'm just going to get outbuilt. I think that's the end of... I think that's the end of that. I don't think I'll be able to... Uh... Ooh, they're attacking down here as well. I don't think I'll be able to... take him out simply because of the... Amount of stuff he's got. Oh, is that ti oh, the tiger? I thought it was. I said tiger. I was like, is that actually a tiger? Uh, tank Mark II. It's just a set of tracks. Uh, nothing on the top. Right, okay. Well, we'll go for the OT Tington because why not? Yeah, I don't think I'll be able to take a lot of these guys out just because of the sheer amount of gear they've got. I mean, look at that. How, how on earth am I supposed to take out? In this case, it is a forest with an artillery station. Three of these. Uh, Black Fortresses, I think they're called. Something like that. Uh, a couple of small ones down the back. And then a boatload of whatever the hell this is. Yeah. Alright. Fine. We'll do our best. That's all we can ask. Oh, but he's attacking up there. See, I want him I want him to move and then I can attack him. That'd be nice. That'd be very good indeed. But. There he's moving. Ah, see, he stops. He keeps stopping. So... Let's stop. Let's go to build airship. And we're going to build. We're going to. We're bringing out the big guns now. We're building reactoring, reacting tons. Because one of the holes in our fleet essentially is. Um, let's move that up there. Is we don't have anywhere to take stuff over. And with what he's got, my best bet is not to destroy them it is to actually take the things over he's also going right up the top there which also leaves him over to attack so if I go over there, yeah he immediately turns round and this guy's now coming towards me so there's nothing I can do to stop that so I'll have to go back and wait so build ship once more keep on building the reacting tons and see what happens I'm hoping that this guy takes him out because he's just going to keep building stuff until he's... <laughs> well, until he's run out of uh, space. Build ship. Again, reacting tent is the way to go. Very, very cheap, these. We're going to have to make a very, very big high-level bomber. Like, with huge, huge gear on it, I think. Probably the way to go. Says the attack, and... Oh! He took it over! I did not expect that! Right, that's... That's not too bad, actually, because I can now invade... Even though this guy's coming towards me and I don't know what he's got. The question is, let's have a look. Let's go to defences. What have I got defence-wise? Not a lot. Okay, let's build a defence then. So, build building. And... Tiny trench? Put a tiny trench system in, why not? There we go. And do I wait? So I don't know what's coming towards me. Viewing this city here, he's got... The walkers, obviously, and a couple of other things. And I can't... I don't know if he's got a great deal of... Nah, there's no way I can I can risk that. No, no, no. I don't know what he's got. I don't know what he's got. So, oh! It looks like I'm getting attacked by the mad scientist. This is not going to go well for me. So, mad scientist... Oh, no, I've got one. And I've got an artillery station and a reactington, which is not going to do anything. But, I will start, and I'm going to see what this artillery station does. So, immediately people are coming out and... What the bloody hell? It blew up. <coughs> right? That's what the artillery station does. Let me repair that thing, whatever it was, because it's just one module. Yeah, whatever that was, it, um... It destroyed it very quickly, as you saw. Um, so what I'll do is I'm going to select that and that, and then I'm going to attack the mad scientist because, quite honestly, I need to take them out, and I will see what's happening over there. So, as you can see, mad scientist, um, they have this tower thing, and what they do is um, fire the, like, I'll hit you with this like lightning uh, contraption, 
but that is really none of my concern at the moment. It's trying to get stuff working in the right order. Okay, so I'm going to move them right above. Uh, the reacting tins will move right forward like so, and this obviously will target that. Now, I don't know... Oh, there we go. Look, it fires this uh, death ray, actually, and oh god, it's firing at this thing. Please don't fire at that. It's very, very expensive. I don't think you appreciate just how expensive that thing is and how long it took. And we've won. Um, I don't know how we managed to win it, but it looks like one of the shots has hit it, and then it got taken out straight away. So that was that. Um, so we've got electronics, we're going to move straight back and then we're going to have another fight and we'll see what they've got and oh my good grief, so they've got, I think we've lost the game. Um, no, 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 focus, focus, we can easily win this, <laughs> he says without any degree of confidence. Um, so we they've got one, two, three, four, five of whatever the hell these are, Intrepid, Renown, Iron Duke, yeah, and then these things as well. Let's just start the fight, we'll see what happens and... Right, that there, I've paused it just at the time when that thing's fired, and that's the sprite. So where's the shot going to go is the question. One quarter speed. It missed. Did it miss? No, it's just hitting there. Alright, let's target that. Um, Artillery station then. Target. Oh, there's the artillery, I think. Hell's bells. That's the artillery coming in. That's really, really cool, actually, that artillery. I mean, it's broken to hell, but whatever. I mean, it's it's cool. Um, although it might have a very, very limited rate of fire. It might be very, very limited. Uh, I put on quarter speed just to see what it was like, but uh, we don't need to do that anymore. So these bombarding things are quite good, the OTTs. But, oh, there's the artillery coming. Incoming! Oh, yes, take the top one out. In fact, yeah, that's a good plan. Since they're not moving, I'm going to shoot the top one. And because look at the look at the arc of fire, that's stupid. Um, what I'm going to do is shoot the top one because then it'll start crushing the bottom ones. That's a good plan. Target the top one. Come on. Oh, we've lost main gun. Main gun's gone. Tracks are falling off. There's the top one going, and she's falling out the sky. There, yeah. There's all the debris. There it goes. Oh, it's starting to move now. That's bad. Yeah, I think they've seen the iceberg. Oh, there's some artillery going on that as well. Okay, you'll target that one. You, artillery, you'll target that one. Uh, we're playing the long game on this one. We need to take out the majority of this stuff and then go for worrying about him. And there's another bit of chain reaction. Where's the other artillery? Come on, artillery. Call it in. And look at that. Look at the trench system go. <laughs> they've got like 40 mils or something. Like bofers or whatever, just blattering away. This thing is the, uh, this is actually just a thing that makes credits, like a shipyard or something, or a munitions factory. So it's, that's why it's um, technically out of action. And, whoa, there's some more secondary explosions. Blown a lot of these ships in half here. And I'm going to target that one. It hit there and did a little bit of damage. I don't know what it's armed with, but it's, uh, it seemed to be armoured quite well, whatever it's got on it. There's that go. And these are armed with just a lot of cannon. So, is he just firing bombs away there? He is bom bombing, yeah. Looks like that's just blown up. You target him. And let's see if we can... There's the artillery. Incoming! Oh, yes! <laughs> ah, I do like a bit of off-board. Oh, no! No, 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 no! The artillery station's gone! Right. That is bad. That is very bad indeed. So I've lost the artillery station. So the fight at the moment is going, I think it's going my way. They've only got, oh, the artillery is still firing though. So maybe it can keep going. I can't order it to fire. Hang on. No, the artillery is still there. It is still there. There's the, there's the beacon. It's just taking a lot of the top off. Excellent. That's what we need to see. So we'll target that bottom. No, we won't target that bottom bit. Well, what we're going to have to do now. Um, I'll target that bit. So there's the artillery incoming. Boom. So the only thing left, I believe, is... Good, good, yeah. Actually, yeah, let's have that discussion. The only thing left is what? Um, that. 
that there, that piece. Target, that there. Oh, yeah, that's still a legitimate ship. It can fly, it can move, and it's got guns. Still is the case, but, you know, very, very close call. Oh, I think we hit the bridge there. And these things here, I don't know where they're getting the ammo from, but... Oh, everyone's happy, look. Yeah, I think we've just won that. That's a lot of debris. That's a victory. And we'll get back. Let's go to defences. Repair. And we're going to repair everything. And we will... Defences. Repair. Should be a repair all button. <laughs> Um, defense is once more over here. Build building. It's going to have to be, I'm afraid, that thing because artillery is very good. And also they make cash. So, in terms of his fleet, it's fairly big. Yeah, and look at those. Those are really, really interesting. Um... Yeah, he's got a lot of stuff. Got a lot of stuff. But my fleet ain't too shabby either. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to repair that up there, I'm going to build this here, and I think we could probably send the fleet off somewhere. But I think we'll do that next episode. Um, For now, I think we're about right. Yeah, so we'll repair this, we'll build this one in here, and so we've got Double artillery, single artillery. Might put another defensive thing in Genericans because, quite honestly, I really think we have to. If we don't, then we're going to have a big problem later on. Um, however, as you can see, that guy is now moving up to Marshville and left this completely exposed, which I'm now going to exploit by moving over there. Obviously, he's going to send reaction vessels to me, but I'll be able to attack him first and... A pause, we'll leave it there. Next episode, we'll see how that fight goes and these two other reaction fights. As always, hope you have enjoyed the video. Let me know in the comments where you think we should go and all of the sort of thing. Thank you very much for watching, take care, and generic partings.